Supplies, Major Nelson. Here it is. The moment you've been waiting for. Unboxing of Xbox One. Let's see what's in the box. So this is what it looks like. It's gorgeous. Turn it around here. You can see everything that's in the box. Nah, I'm not going to show you there. We're going to break into this bad boy right now. First thing you notice right up top is we have the Kinect sensor. Here's this uh, beautiful little sensor. I'm going to pop that down here. Mm. You can see that right there. Talk about each one of these items in a minute. Next up, we have, of course, headset. Ooh, it's going to be beautiful. Following that, the controller itself. Put that here. Next up, we have a 4K rated HDMI cable. Some paperwork, including the manual. Little Xbox One sticker. Over here, we have the, uh, the power cord. Here's the power brick. And then underneath, we have the beautiful console all wrapped up, waiting for you to take a look at it. Are you ready? Take a look at this. All right, I have everything laid out here on the table. Let's go through each item one by one. First up, we have some paperwork here, including your owner's manual, as well as a little sticker. And if you were lucky enough to get your hands on a day one edition, this is where you'll find your code for your digital exclusive. Now over here, we have the Xbox One console, liquid black, beautiful. You can see right on the front here, it's a slot loading Blu-ray drive. Let me spin it around on the side here. Uh, you can see you've got a super speed USB 3.0 port as well as a uh, binding button to get your controller set up. And then on the back, we have the ports. From left to right, we have the power port. We have the HDMI output to your television followed by the SPDIF or optical audio out. Then we have HDMI in, which is uh, from your satellite or cable box. Next to that, we have two USB 3 super speed ports. Next to that is Connect. Now Connect is an IR blaster, so you can use that. Or if your system requires it, you can use an IR out port, and that's this guy right here. Next to that is a gigabit ethernet port, followed by a Kensington security lock. And inside we have a 500 gigabyte hard drive, an 8-core x86 processor, and wireless networking connectivity all on board. Next up, we have an HDMI cable. Now, this is a 4K-capable HDMI cable that we're including in the box. Also, we have, of course, the power supply. Next, we have the Xbox One controller with over 40 improvements. We have a newly designed D-pad. We have impulse triggers on the back here, which are going to change the way you game. And then, of course, you can see this is the special Day 1 edition, which has a little logo there and a chrome D-pad. Hot! Next, we have the Kinect sensor, which has improved gesture and voice control, a greater field of view so it will work in almost any room, and 1080p video for Skype. And both the day one and standard editions of the console include this mono chat headset, improved comfort, inline audio controls, and improved audio quality for in-game chat. One more thing I haven't shown you, the on-off switch. We've done something pretty cool here. I'll see you games.